Okay guys, this is uh, about to get primed with the epoxy primer. Went ahead and got all the sanding and the masking and everything done. I went ahead and threw this over here because I don't want to have uh, anything uh, get on that hood, that other hood. But yeah, we got it all masked up. It's ready to go. And next step, uh, I'll be spraying on the car. Okay guys, I went ahead and sprayed the epoxy. This is the T-Rex brand, um, white epoxy. I went ahead and sprayed this on here. We've gotten it pretty well uh, covered. Next thing we'll do is we'll get it unmasked. It's dark out here so I know it's hard to see, but I went ahead and got it all sprayed. It's really tight in here. 
but anyway that's uh done we got the top really good there's two coats on the top on the side rails on the back and on the deck lid and i went ahead and got probably two coats on the doors too but i went ahead and just dusted the doors down i wasn't really worried about it but on the tops here in this area right here i got uh, probably three full coats on there of the epoxy i mixed up a little too much so that's where i put it right in the top of those doors so now the next step is going to be to let this cure uh, overnight it'll dry it's um uh, it's not a rapid cure or anything so it takes quite a while to dry and it's uh it's still wet actually you can still touch it and and, and run into some spots that are still wet and we've sprayed it probably 30 minutes ago but uh it's a four to one mix uh epoxy um that t-rex sells and the next step like i said will be the 99 high, high prime we'll go ahead and uh, check this out scuff it down if we have to in any spaces where there's any debris or garbage in it and we're going to go ahead and pound down the uh silco high prime here 99 high prime and uh go ahead and get us a nice surface and then we'll start our blocking process we still have to fix the dents in the door right over here there's a dent right there you still got to fix that one and a few other little dings like there's one right here but we'll get all that fixed and then we'll prime it but uh the tent seemed to work out pretty good uh we sprayed pretty good and uh i will say one thing about the epoxy that stuff was a lot thicker than i thought it was going to end up being i ended up running a one nine millimeter and then i end up using the flag five one eight millimeter because the one nine got clogged up it was uh it was that thick so it was as thick as any of the other high builds that i've used and it said it would be a uh, one one four you could use a one four with it and you'd have to reduce it so much to get it thin enough to go through a one four millimeter nozzle that i didn't feel comfortable doing that so anyway that's going to be all i got for this video guys and uh please like and subscribe and uh comment thanks for watching